Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome back to my expl my let's play of Echo the Dolphin. My X play. There you go. Uh, today we'll be tackling the City of Forever, which houses the time machine, which we need to do to go back in time to recover the globe of a being called the asteroid. I just recently found out um, that asteroid actually means little star in I don't know what language, but it means little star. So, uh, very interesting what relevance it has. Probably nothing. So, let's go. Ooh, tense music. Um, there is a lot of shortcuts in this level. I don't remember many of them, so... I doubt we'll be taking two. I remember one of them. That's about it. Ooh. Alright, where are we going here? It's been a few weeks since I... Well, not a few weeks, but... A little while since I've played... So, let's see. I'm doing a mass uploading session right now. Alrighty. What's this do? Nothing? Oh, blank globe. There you go. There's a jump here. Wow, I almost made it first attempt. I'm pretty sure there's a short... And this is the shortcut I do remember. There's one somewhere around here. I think there's a shortcut around here. Okay, I thought there was. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong. Ah, there it is. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Because you gotta make some jumps. Yeah, I do remember. Oh. Now we gotta make these massive jumps. For I don't know why Atlantis has such huge jumps. And the Atlanteans, they must be able to jump really high. To build a city like this. I should have went down there. Oh, almost had it. I had a perfect opportunity. Oh, there we go. Made it. Like I said, you just got to get the angle properly. And... Oh, and you should do fun. Come on, Echo, jump. Whoa, that was good. Oh, come on, Echo. Doesn't help that I have the sun in my eyes. At this time of the year, the sun just blares in my living room window. I can It's really difficult. It's right in my eyes. I'm um, not doing this on a laptop. I'm doing this on a home computer. Oh, come on, Echo. Oh, oh. oh but this doesn't take the whole video. Oh, come on. Stupid echo. Ugh. Oh, wow. Almost glitched through there. You're just going to hear me making grunting noises. Because, uh, yeah, making grunting noises helps you uh, beat games. Helps your character get, uh, helps you get in one with your character, I should say. Oh, come on. Oh, I've never been good at these jumps, even when I played this game. When I was younger, I was never good at these. I don't know what the angle is you have to go at. Like, see, that didn't work out. That didn't work out. Whoa, I like float on the water for a sec there. Come on, Echo. I don't know the trick to these, ladies and gentlemen. So anyway, hope you're all doing good, having good days. Um, I've already got uh, my next Let's Play project uh, underway. A little preview for you. It'll be Desert Strike on the Sega Genesis. A uh, chopper game. Ugh. When I'll be starting that, I don't know. Um, because we're getting into the more difficult levels of Echo. Um, so. Oh, come on. So we want to... Um, I don't know if I'm going to finish this right away. I might start my Desert Strike Let's Play just to change it up a little bit. Uh, seeing if, if I get stuck on certain levels or if I get sick of the game. Oh, this jump. But yeah, so that's... Um, finally. So that's my next Let's Play project. Uh, will I do the whole Strike series? I don't know. Because there's three... Um, actually, I think there's five Strike games. There's three on the Sega Genesis, though. There's Desert Strike... Uh, Jungle Strike and Urban Strike. And, um, I can't find a working ROM of Jungle Strike. Every one I've downloaded doesn't seem to work. There's always a glitch or something in it. So, 
I may end up doing that one with the Super Nintendo ROM. Uh, it's the same game, just different controls slightly. And then doing Urban Strike on the Sega Genesis. They were the third one. So, that's the plan. So we'll see how that goes. Of course, my uh, big project is my uh, StarCraft one. That'll be down the road, though. Oh, finally. Look at that drop. Woo! Echo's fallen. Alright, where do we gotta go? What's this do? Where do we gotta go? Now, I don't know where we gotta go, so... Let's check up here first. Okay, this seems to go the same way. Okay, we can't go this way. Alright, we go back here. Like I said, there is a lot of shortcuts in this level, but I don't remember any of them, so... Uh, let's see what's over here with echolocation. Uh, no, nothing at all. Alright, let's continue. Alright, we're going up here. Fish! That we don't need. I don't know why there's two blocks here. Okay, we gotta go up here. Oh, air. Nope, a headless uh, Hercules or whoever that guy is. Let's go a little right first. Let's make sure I get my lefts and rights not mixed up because I've already done that. Oh, there's a glyph down there. Excellent. Alrighty. Uh, whoa. What's down here? Oh boy, this, this don't look good. I do remember this level being pretty massive. Search for the key glyph. Really? That's all you have to say to me. Jeez, I've just been doing that all game. Huh. I need some oxygen. Oh, wow, they turned the puffer fish. I actually did not know that. Straight up did not know that. I have just found that out. Is it these guys? Yep. Yeah. yeah. I'm getting out of here. I totally did not know those turned into black puffer fish. <laughs> you learn something new every day. I've been playing this game since, well, a long time. Many years. Since my young years. Since I was a young lad. A young laddie. Okay. I don't know why I'm checking all these. I could probably just echo location and see. Alright. What's this? Access granted. Excellent. Access granted to where? I don't know. What's over here? What? I thought there was a glyph somewhere in here. Whoa! What did that do? I have no idea where I am. And it doesn't help this music is cryptic as everything. <laughs> it's cryptic as all hell. I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, wow. That's why I hate secrets. Oh, okay. I'm in a secret area. Nice. I did not remember this. I've probably found this before, but... Um... Uh... Wait a minute. What's down here? There's got to be something down here. Why would they give me a block if there's nothing down here? Echolocation time! Hmm, weird. I'm gonna go down there just to check, and if it goes far, then I'm not gonna follow it. Time travel sequence initiated. Traveler Echo. Are you kidding me? Did I just beat the level? Oh, wow. This is the time machine, yeah! We just beat the level. Oh, wow. I just use a shortcut. Well, this is the time machine, ladies and gentlemen. Up here, there's these things. I always thought these looked like teeth. I don't know why, but don't they look like teeth? Look, you see the little roots there? Anyway, going on a tangent. How you use that is you just sing a song into the time machine. And you get flushed down a toilet. Farewell, Echo. Farewell, our hero. Whoa, where are we? This is so creepy. <laughs> I remember when I first played this game, this creeped the hell out of me. That music. Where are we? What? What is going on? What is this? Ah! What are those things? They look like eels. Okay. They're actually prehistoric sharks is the actual, I think, game title for them. Um, anyway, wow, there's a lot of them. So we are back 55 million years. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. So we got these big eels. I just call them eels. 
and pretty aggressive, so we're gonna see near the surface. Anyway, uh, this is a separate level. Um, if you die, you just respawn here. So uh, we're gonna continue the recording um, in the next part um, from this level. So um, yeah, that was the um, City of Forever. Definitely didn't take forever to beat, so um, I totally didn't even know about that secret, by the way. I'm, I'm dead serious, so that's good. So we will continue when our hero fights off dinosaurs and other um, prehistoric creatures. I can't think of any right now. So join me then. See you later. <laughs>